Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Golden Sun Dark Dawn. This is Drake Lore 56, the hero you're better off without. Well, here we are at the entrance of Mirai Temple. Let's uh, head on in, shall we? Try to get to this inside class and out in a, a good amount of time. If all goes well, we should actually do this in this episode. And this kind of sounds like less of a temple and more of a creepy castle. Well, the background music is. Ooh, what's this? What's in here? Ah, tease. Alright, so... I want to move that block. I want to see what's on the other side of that. So we're gonna have to... Wait, no, no, I didn't want to do fireball. Crap. There we are, air and heat. Yeah, let's put, yeah, that looks good. Because we're going to be using those two a lot. At first, I think what I'm going to do is make a little shortcut here. Eh, didn't want to jump across. That's more like it. Let's see here. A letter. Basically, the letter is like, yeah, good job getting into the temple, but the inside class isn't immediately inside. You have to go f deeper. Even though it's quite apparent there's a door right in there, in the water there, and a, yep, new enemy, Merman. Uh, yeah. Hell, he wins. See how this works. Oh, that's good. And Merman didn't need to uh, have any the chance to show off his skills. Yeah, okay. So, I want to get that chest that's apparently up there. Oh, yeah. You go up and around again. Finicky stylus controls. Alright, what's in here? It better not be nothing. Stormbrand. Yes, that is worth it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that works. That works. Alright, let's, uh, pick it. Yeah, I think that'll work for Karis. Now her attack isn't complete crap compared to her one strike during the battle against the Sand Prince. Alright, let's uh, continue our journey through this little temple, huh? Lizard Men! I th if I remember correctly, if these guys are weak to fire for whatever reason. <laughs> That's a giant ass sword you have there, Matthew! Yep, they're they're weak to uh, to fire. One down? Got it. Yeah, very simplistic puzzle here. All right. 
Alright, so this leads to that room. This leads to the same room, but we get a kimono! Who gets this? Uh, let's give it to Matthew. His yeah, his defense is needed something. In fact, everybody says defense is needs a little something, but we couldn't afford anything. Uh, let's looks like all three of those doors lead to the same room, but the right side was the only way to actually progress. And if this is a pretty easy puzzle, you can just solve it with two of these blocks here. Well, of course, you're going to have to estimate where the uh, the blocks are going to be once the water rises again. Okay, yeah, we're going to have to put it right here. I want to make sure we make it to the door. And we certainly don't need that one there. There we are! We're going through this pretty- oh, I see you! I see you there, little guy! I want you! Why would, uh, would you come to me? Oop! New enemy, Hydra! Let's give it some laser therapy. Apparently, we're that strong against the enemies. Yep. Yeah. Well, let's just at least do this. We're gonna have to have to drain it sooner or later. You enemy cuddle. So let's have these guys take care of the higher because apparently it's been proven that we can take it down in one friggin' turn. Quite a bit of damage. Ooh, that's an interesting attack. And down goes the cuddle. Wow, for as sparse as the as the encounter rate is... Oh, what's this say? When water pours into the pool, the path to an ancient rug shall open upon its surface. Okay, so we're gonna have to turn on some water, sort of like what we did in Mercury Lighthouse. So, let's see here. We're gonna have to go... So, this little... This is a little bit of a ramp that is weighted. So, we don't need that fill just yet. Well, as I was saying before, as as sparse as the encounter rates are, we certainly get a lot of experience. Especially for bosses. Looks like we can actually go around this way. I'm stupid. Alright, so let's douse this. It's amazing how such a brief exposure to to rain fills that entire thing. All right, so okay, so looks like we just need to push this guy down and through here into a very easy puzzle. It is impossible to fuck this up. Impossible. Because you got so many uh, entrances to any part of this puzzle. So yeah, with that done, you can just fill up that little bowl and we'll start the little waterworks here. There we are. 
apparently an elephant's nose. So what we're gonna have to do now is have the flow go the other way. Onto that little flow there. Easy. Unfortunately, we've got this little plant here. We can actually get up, so we just have to uh, get to that little uh, little river there. And down we water slide. I. Still ain't wanting to get you. That was easy. You have reached the true sanctum, Adams, where you will now gain the ancient site of the Janae. Cool. You look kind of grumpy. Those who possess the inside glass must heed a dire Janae warning. Alchemy must never be restored to the world. No oh, problem with that! That kinda already happened! Just saying. It would bring ruin of all things. The one who possesses the inside glass must fight to return uh, the return of alchemy. Again, that already happened. A little late there, pal. Inside energy will grant you the vision to see what is, what should be done next to see solutions. So basically, it is the one-stop cheat shop in terms of psi energy synergy. I keep on using that. So basically, yeah, but it looks like the inside glass is chosen. The immediate, even the. Uh, Big ol' face there, a surprise. Now attempt using insight synergy. Here it goes. Yeah, yeah, it's underwhelming. What was that? Is it saying I should use whirlwind synergy here? And why wasn't that a term before? Insert synergy. It grants a view of objects and people that can help you find a way forward. What an amazing power! How curious that the inside glass chose its owner. An immediate of all people. It's a meaty? Hey! Why can't it be me? Because you're you, Terrell. Shut up! How odd that the inside glass would choose the meaty out of all the atoms. I'm honored, of course, but I cannot say why it would choose me over any of you. Well, who knows why it turned the rest of us down. At least we found the inside glass, so let's return to King Pythos. Before we do, there's still the little matter of that Jenny I want. Yeah, now you notice it. Way to go, Matthew. Maybe the inside class will, and its power it grants it would be some use right now. Okay. Okay, a fireball. Blast it with a fireball. Got it. Let's do just that. I imagine he's not going to be happy with us. That's so. Alright. Let's get this rather rotund Ginny. 
Uh oh, all oh, right. I forgot that I have a Jupiter Ginny on Matthew. Well, at least we'll get to see what that synergy looks like. Okay, that's interesting. <laughs> Wow! That was a cool looking turn there. But now the genie gets a little laser treatment. Or not, we got him! Surge! Okay, not entirely sure what that does, but I think I'm gonna chain and fix these. Yeah, there we are. There. Ginny fixed. Alright, I think that'll do it for this episode. All we have to do is just get out of here. I'm. So I think I'm gonna. As I was saying, I think that'll do it for this episode. So I. I'm going to head out the, uh. The f to the entrance of this the temple and well I'm well f and the episode right here so if you like this one hit the like button comment on it and if you want subscribe so until next time see you later I'm getting off the fucking ladder